How do you do, sneak peekers? You having a good day? No, I am. Just caught one of them new pictures at the movie palace. It was one of them prequels, you know, a movie for a movie. It's called Pearl. It's about this young farm girl who wants to be a star, but she's held back by her strict German mother and her bedridden father. Now, while she's waiting for her hubby to come back from the Great War, her best friend ropes her into signing up for a dance audition, but her violent and deadly tendencies get in the way of her journey to stardom. Now, this picture is set against a beautiful and vibrant, idyllic backdrop, mimicking the technicolor wonder of the period that it takes place. It's very Wizard of Oz-esque, and absolutely works for this kind of period piece horror film. The simple country farm environment is capable of producing so many different kinds of feelings, from the eeriness of being secluded, to the daily tasks of milking the cows. Ty West manages to balance these two tones tremendously in his horror villain origin story. Now while some of the supporting cast feels a bit stiff, it's Mia Goth that absolutely shines as young Pearl. Don't let her simple farm girl voice and rosy cheeks fool you. She can smile the biggest smile in the world, smack dab in the middle of a meltdown, and show you how truly terrifying she can be. You know, one of the best up and coming actresses of our time, Goth gets us to believe that she is Pearl. She has that X factor needed to show the world that she was born to be a star. She will eviscerate anyone or anything that gets in her way. Now, although I love the majority of the film, I was left wondering one question. What was the purpose of all this? I mean, obviously it's Pearl's origin story, but it didn't really feel like an origin because at one point we learned that Pearl has always been this way. If you liked X, then you'll enjoy this flick. But if you were hoping for some kind of nuanced clarification behind her bloodlust, you might be a little disappointed. Nonetheless, Pearl shows that this story is definitely a passion project for Wes, and with the futuristic sequel Maxine set to release next, well, this trilogy will be a cult classic for years to come. Now, have you seen Pearl yet? If you have, let us know what you think at Sneak Peek TV on our social media. If you haven't seen the film yet, you don't plan on it, well, I take it you don't and never will have that X factor.